This is speed modeling for Katia V5 or for the whole tool. Uh, so the whole tool is right here. It's part of sketch based features. You pick the whole tool and then you have to pick the surface that you want the hole on. Don't worry about where you pick it. It will ask you in a minute where you want to place it exactly. So you pick the surface. That's just saying I picked the surface, not the location. It just brings out a representation of it just to show you that that's where it's, uh, what it looks like as far as diameter and depth goes. Uh, you have a choice of blind, meaning dimension, if you were in pad and pocket and all the others. Um, I want it to go up to last, so it'll go all the way through. Uh, we'll say two centimeter diameter. You can see it update. Um, and then the thing you want probably to go to first is the positioning sketch. So you hit that and there is the center point of the hole. You can constrain that however you like, like there, and it will go green when I get it fully constrained. Done. Exit out there. You say that's the hole I want. You hit exit and then there's the hole. The thing that makes this beneficial is not that it can make a hole like that when we could have easily have just used a pocket. The thing that it can do for us is we can go to type and we can choose from either a tapered one, see so watch if I hit preview, just a, a big cone that it carves out of it, um, or I can go uh, countersunk, right, like a countersunk fastener, um, counter board like an Allen head screw, that doesn't really look like an Allen, you have your choice to um, option to do that here, change that and the depth of it. So say two, how about just one? See, so then it kind of starts to look like an, an Allen head screw. You would make measurements, take measurements off the actual the fastener that you're putting in there. There we go. Uh, counter bore or counter drilled. And you can see all that over here in this small little picture is trying to draw you, uh, show you what it's about to do. So this one is kind of a combo. It will counter bore it down, counter sink it after that. Uh, hit OK. And that's it. That's the whole tool. There's also a thread option as well. Although, um, and more of this is in the uh, tutorial section, the full tutorial. Um, I can tell it to be threaded, but um, Katia does not show threads, so it becomes kind of useless if you plan on making or using threads for a 3D printer. So that is the whole tool for speed modeling.